Cobb County has a new assistant chief deputy in town. Gina B. Hawkins just joined the sheriff's office one month ago, becoming the highest ranking Hispanic official there. Apalacero sat down with a woman who has spent more than three decades in law enforcement. Box after box. This is one of the things that um, I have in my office typically. Gina V. Hawkins unpacks her culture. My grandparents are indigenous Kuna Indians. The first thing she unwrapped, a handmade indigenous textile from Panama. My mother is Panamanian and my dad is black. My dad met my mother when he was in the Air Force in Panama. Her past influences her present as the Cobb County Sheriff's Office Assistant Chief Deputy. She's the highest ranking Hispanic and Afro Latina official here. And with 34 years in law enforcement under her belt, she's seen how diversity can lead to trust. The trust is not there from their culture and then the trust in law enforcement was not all the way there. The fear of be, being able to be judged um, just by how you look. It does make a difference, so um, I definitely believe that trust is important. She started out working for Atlanta police for nearly 20 years. Then when Sandy Springs first became a city, she helped create its police department. And after seven years, she became the Clayton County Police Deputy Chief and later became the police chief in Fayetteville, North Carolina. She then briefly retired. And then I got a phone call um, at this opportunity. And it was good because although I'm retired from that, I didn't want to stop the work. Hawkins says she was recently drawn to the office because of its diverse demographics. Data shows the agency is 47% black, 46% white, and 5% Hispanic. He has the most diverse demographics within command staff and within the ranks. To have within the ranks males and females of all races, um, be represented, shows you there are competent people helping make decisions. Hawkins says Sheriff Craig Owens also just appointed the office's first Hispanic liaison, helping hire more diverse, experienced staff. You will want to go work someplace where someone like you also exists so you don't feel alone. Paula Suro, 11 Alive News.